Yo, what's good guys? Welcome on in. My stream just started. We are starting a brand new endless run today. How exciting, huh? Cosmo says, hey, I lost around 130 of the Arceus because I forgot to heal. It happens to the best of us, man. So Vix, J, Yoda, Cosmo, a random person. Mewtwo rules? I've never used Mewtwo before, so this is going to be exciting. I've hatched them from an egg. Uh, how do I set it up? Endless. We're going to do an endless run with Mewtwo, okay? That is the plan for today. I've never used him before. We hatched him. We got Moonblast. I don't even have his uh, abilities unlocked. We only have Pressure. His passive. I don't remember what it is. I think it's Normal Force. Let me take a look here. Yeah, Normal Force. Uh, I need a new nature for him. <laughs> we have negative speed, but that should be okay. His speed is pretty fast anyway, so I think we can bear of that. Yo, Seminole, what's up, man? Hello, Starry. Destiny. Welcome on in. First time hopping into one of your streams, gonna stick around for a bit. Recently started playing Poke Rogue, so I don't know much, but it seems fun nonetheless for sure, man. Game is super addicting. But I hope you enjoy your time on the game. That's awesome. Okay, guys, the plan for today is to start a new endless run. Um, we're gonna be using Mewtwo. So let's add him to the party. He already costs eight out of the 15 slots we have, right? I don't know what I want to do with him because he has a mega form. He can either be a physical attacker or a special attacker, depending on what we decide for him. So if we go with the physical attack route, we can combine him with like Mawile for huge power or even uh, Tinkaton. But Tinkaton's uh, huge power is passive, so we would have to fuse Mewtwo into Tinkaton instead. So I'm thinking. But. This, this one right here, it has Magical Torque. I have that move on Zacian, which was kind of insane, so... Having it on Tinkaton could be huge for us, but we'll see. This game has taken over my life. I hear you on that, dude. <laughs> I think uh, we're all in the same boat here. Okay, so we added Mewtwo. Debating if I want to take him. Let's add the rest of the team for now. Well, add... The Garganacle. Make sure he has sturdy this time. We did a run where we gave him Purifying Soul and I didn't realize until we fought Eternus that he didn't have sturdy. So I kind of goofed on that. Let's get in our runaway Pokemon. And then... I don't think we'll play this far enough where we have to do the, the Poison Heal strat, but I never tested it out, so I kind of want to try it. And Paris already has Sappy Seed anyway, so that's pretty good. I don't need a Leech Seed anymore. So I think I will add him to the team. And he costs nothing. Look, 0.5. Might as well just take him, right? And we still have four points left, which is exactly enough for either Mawile or Tinkatink. So if we go with Tinkaton, I think it will be better long term. But we would have to fuse Mewtwo into him, so... Shall we try that? I think that would be the plan for today's session. So yeah, exactly 15 points. We'll lead with Mewtwo and then we'll see how the run goes. All right. <clears throat> Just got a blue shiny Mian Chao. On my LS, I finally got max shiny charms and only gotten two shinies in 200 floors. I just recently beat Classic Run. Should I continue to do Classic or start Endless? Try out uh, Endless and see how it goes for you. Guys, we just uploaded a new video. If you could do me a favor, I'm going to link it to you guys real quick. Oh my god, this is the accusation video. This is where um, we address the accusations on uh, people saying that we hacked the game. So if you guys can, video is in the chat. Give it a like, please. I would appreciate that a lot. I also... Uh, shout out the stream. So anybody watching the video that might be joining in from uh, that video, so that'd be nice. But yeah, let's start. We have Moonblast on Mewtwo. I don't know if um we'll keep this on him, because if we're gonna make him a physical attacker, right? We'll just replace that with Magical Torque. Yo, it was good, Cooper. Also, um. 
since you guys have been watching the stream, I did change a few things here and there. So allow me to elaborate on that. I'm sure you can have this. Um, I made it so if you guys want to redeem um, vouchers, so anytime you want to see like egg pulls during the stream, you can spend your channel points on it. All you got to do is uh, click your channel points down in the chat. Trust me, when you watch the stream, you're going to gain so many channel points. And this is so um, a lot of people, once we start getting more people watching the stream as well, I don't want like 20 people redeeming at the same time. And that's like all my vouchers right there. And then we can't do pulls anymore ever again. <laughs> yeah. So save up your points. And we'll do um, some other redemptions in the future too. Because there are like activities that I want to implement. Like um, I want to do like a, a community event where we could play like bingo. Anything that happens during our run. You can like mark it off on that. Do you have any tips for classic? I have a few legendaries because I got lucky with the roulette spins. Been doing recent with Darkrai, but I feel like I could change it up something. Okay, um, let's see. Uh, name some of the Pokemon you got. We could probably build a team for you. El Pikachu, hello, hello. I got six legendaries and eight shinies today. Yeah, I saw. And you also got um, a shiny Garganacle, right? That's massive, dude. It's so nice to start off with like the Pokemon that you're eventually going to be fusing with anyways. I think I'll take that. Like now, I never have to worry about getting a, a pickup Pokemon or a, uh, a Soul Cure ever again. Well, I don't know if it's just me, but we're having server issues. Yo, it's good, Ken. Good to see you again. That rhymes. Imagine Ace with a Mewtwo build. That's how I look IRL. Like, not when he's like skin and bones like that, but like after he gets his Mega Evolution when he's bulky. Your last two videos are going stupid crazy. Yeah, we've been grinding for that. Um, alongside like VODs, um, anything that we stream, we normally would just upload it to YouTube. But other than that, uh, we try to work on at least like one dedicated video a week. Yo, Rizzy, what's up? And Carl, thank you for the fall. Ace, will you do another face cam stream? Probably. It's just my camera overheats all the time and it's so annoying. If you ever watch my streams like in the beginning of my Poke Rogue runs, my camera would just shut off like every five minutes. Just because you guys are too hot, that's why. Ace face reveal? It's not hard to uh, see my face. It's literally in my profile picture on Switch. Or my Twitter or my YouTube videos. <laughs> Wait, that's actually you? Love to hear it, man. You inspire me to grind again. That's awesome, man. Are you like huge into the competitive scene for like Scarlet and Violet? Or do you like play um, other Pokemon games still? I know you mentioned that um, you're heavily into uh, Rogue right now just because of how addicting it is. Which is completely understandable because I'm pretty much in the same boat right now. I think we all are. Considering that we're here. <laughs> right now I have Tinkatana with Gartana. Okay. Yeah, that's a, a fairly common build that I see people are doing with the Beast Boost. I'm, I might do the same thing, but my uh, Tinkaton is going to be fused with Mewtwo. But you're doing what? Huge power with Beast Boost? Have you tried a challenge run? Doing Gen 8 is hard. I haven't done any of the challenge runs yet. 
I did a lot of challenge runs prior to when they implemented that. Yo, look at this guy. He has magical torque, shift gear, and ice hammer. I think I might swap this out eventually for like fake out or something. We also got to get Mewtwo uh, a new nature. Smackdown. But yeah, give me some updates on your runs. It's been almost an entire day since we last talked. Are you guys still continuing your classic and endless runs? Aside from Cosmo, Cosmo said, Yeah, I was playing and I forgot to heal my Arceus. How oh, do you forget to heal your Pokemon? It happens to me all the time. The worst is when you don't have enough money to heal your Pokemon and then it's like right before a major battle. It's tough, man. I cry every time. Yo, quick hi before bedtime. Wish you an amazing stream and run. Yo, thank you, Escaroda. Much appreciated. Wait, you're on 2k? Yeah, you're chilling, dude. <laughs> if you can make it that far in Endless, you can just grind for whatever you want in this game. Opinion I've used Timber and Wulu together. Wulu. The guy from Power World? Why? Cycle cut. Hey, nap nap. Good to see you again. Because his bulk has Fluffy? Okay. That's a new strat. I've never heard that one before. If it works for you, it works for you, you know? You're in ear pain? I'll try to keep it down then. Guys, no screaming in the chat. Yeah, I reached floor 5,000 with Maridon and Regirock. What kind of Regirock? Kane, okay, what was that game you played uh, yesterday? The RPG one. That looks so fun. I might actually get it. It's not Sea of Stars, right? CDs? Sea of Fantasy. There we go. I looked it up and I accidentally looked up uh, Sea of Stars and it's a completely different uh, RPG game. It's mostly like uh, Chrono Trigger, if you ever played that. Back on the SNES. I think you're the first person I've heard that has ever used Wulu. Like, unironically. Rock smash, I'll pass. For real, I'm grinding vouchers and shinies. I have 195 plus right now. Yo, Seminole, I just recently uploaded a video because people have been like commenting on all my videos like, yo, this guy's been hacking the game. There's no way he has that many vouchers. But bro, if you just play endless, you do literally anything in this game, it's so easy to make vouchers, especially now since they changed the update for the way you can get vouchers in the reward shop. They made it so much easier compared to before. When are you duo streaming t YouTube and TikTok? Isn't TikTok going to be banned in America? It's time for me to move to Canada. See you guys later. Diego is in the shop today, so I don't know if I want to pull for it because I already got the egg move I needed from him. We're just waiting for Rayquaza or something else. What is the easiest way to beat Classic? Um, 
I mean, if you just want to cheese it, you could just go for like damage over time moves. So like curse, uh, stealth rocks, leech seed if you want to. I mean, it's not much of a challenge. I, I do a lot of classic runs on my YouTube videos and I never bring in Pokemon that already have like good egg moves or IVs. It's usually just a Pokemon I catch in the wild. But yeah, it's more fun just to do trial and error in my opinion. So see what works for you. Just no like real meta for how this game uh, should be played. At least that's just my opinion. I always advocate for the fun route in this game. Wait, you're playing Poke Rogue, and you're not playing it the way I like it? How dare you? Get one shot. Taco Tack is a cat. I like that name. <laughs> we had some fish tacos today. It was so expensive. It was two fish tacos for $18. What a waste of money. But the place we went to was like in the middle of the ocean. So the only way to get um, to the restaurant is by boat. Unless you want to like swim there. So yeah, I just took my Kyogre. No big deal. YouTube money got you spending for real, for real. Yeah, we kind of balling right now with the 50 cents that we're making. Project Delta, hello. Wait, that's like my name. Do you want to do a collab? I've been abusing Eternatus because he bullied me last endless run. Good. He deserves it. Shiny weekend coming off for real? How do you know? You guys getting these patch notes or does your dad own Poke Rogue or something? Hey, hey, hope you're doing well. Likewise. Thanks so much for the follow and uh, tuning in the stream. How many people here in the chat came from YouTube? Just me? I heard it from 10 different sources. Rumors. The he said, she said. Me. Okay, but who was the first person that came from YouTube? Wait, still you guys? I believe it. Me for sure, true. Sweet kiss. I'm not even paying attention to my game because I'm more like engaged with chat right now. So if something happens and we lose our run, um, and we might ban Kang for it. Sorry, Kang. I came from YouTube though, literally put it as my first message, true. I heard they're working on the shop right now for the achievements. So you get to spend your points on some items to help you with your runs. Looks pretty cool. I wonder how they get to do it though. Is Majorna's AZ Floet any good? I have no idea. I'll be honest, when I play this game, I just use the same Pokemon every time. You think I'm gonna try a new meta? Probably. Eventually I will have to. 
I wonder if the passes will apply to the current runs. Most likely. I don't see why I shouldn't. Unless you're playing on like an offline account or something. That's what I'm saying, Jay. If it's not broke, why fix it, you know? But nah. Every video you always see me with Latio, so I gotta switch things up. Someone's watching my videos like, this guy's still using that Latios, man? Come on. No, but I do want to experiment just because of how many people are saying like they're having trouble with um, choosing starter Pokemon. And this is not a good example considering I'm still using a Legendary. But even then, it's not that hard to get a Legendary Pokemon, even like a sub-Legendary from an Epic Egg. Just get a Legendary, am I right? You just got everything perfect on a Pokemon, like IV wise? What did you lose the, the last run to? I didn't lose the last run, we still have it. We just don't want to play anymore. Oh my god. We got Tinkatuff. She kind of angry right now. Oh! I just lost Massacre Torque. Big F in the chat. Palkia is going crazy right now on your run. Dude, I used Palkia for the first time and that was the fastest time I've ever completed Classic compared to like everything else I use. It gave you achievement? Yeah. Perfect Pokemon. I got mine from uh, hatching a an egg. Yeah, if you have Water Spout and Dragon's Energy on uh, Palkia, you're all set, man. That's kind of insane to have. Two moves that hit like two adjacent Pokemon, as well as doing 150 power. Sign me up. Cloud says, yo, been watching your vids on YouTube, loving them so far. Thank you, Cloud. I appreciate you watching them and for tuning into the stream. It's on a tarantula. How does he have a ball of yarn on his back? Call it to Palkia, so no egg moves. I hear you. They're called egg moves for a reason, am I right? Cloud underscore S underscore just subscribed. Yo, massive. Thank you, Cloud. I appreciate the sub, dude. Whoa, ain't no way. Is that who I think it is in my chat right now? Oh, shoot. I would have raided you if I knew you were alive these days. I'm too tired to even close my stream properly, lol. I should not start stream this late 3 a.m. You've been grinding, though. Much respect, man. You deserve a well long rest. But no worries, dude. No worries at all. Wait, wait, wait. Ready? Ready? How's my pronunciation? Uh, Kinete Kukje. How's that? I've been practicing. Do you usually go live around this time? I want to say yes, but at the same time, I'm very inconsistent. So I just go live whenever I feel like it. But I'll just say yes. Yeah, we got a streaming schedule. Yeah, we're consistent. Okay. Our first rogue tier item. Oh wait, it's not rogue tier. It's actually ultra. Just got two legendary eggs from a 10 pole on Dialga. Uh, share. Alright chat, be honest with me. You think we can clear floor 50 here? 
What's gonna be our biggest weakness? Probably a dark type, right? Oh, we got... I think it's tough. Yo, sounds good, Seminole. I appreciate that so much, man. Have a great rest of your night as well. Oh, it's Screamtail. What do we got for it? Oh my god, that is nothing. Isn't there a pity system now? And if so, how does it work? I'll be honest, I have no idea. They should do a better job at trying to uh, make it more apparent. From my understanding, there is a pity system. And I can't deny it because I pulled three legendary eggs in one pull. But at the same time, I'm not sure how it works. Currently at work, so I'll be lurking good luck on the run. Good luck with your work. I bought that grind though. Today was the most spent on trying to be classic mode on a fresh account with resets. Better known as a hardcore. Yeah, I was watching for a little bit when I was on the road. Kind of crazy. Lose a run, delete the account. Hardcore Iron Man for real. What do you think the best moves for a Lugia are? I don't know. Um, there's a, a website. If you guys are interested, I'll put it in the chat right now. I'll even make a command for it real quick. There you go. Uh, website is in the chat. But you just go to Lugia right here. Click it. It tells you everything that you need to know about the Pokemon. You can even see the shinies for a regular shiny, rare, epic. Oh my god, you get the shadow version? Wait. I didn't know that's actually the shadow version. That's sick. Okay. Um, it tells you like everything you need to know. The abilities, the passive, the biomes that you can catch them in. Even like the weaknesses. So good. And then if you scroll down, you get the four egg moves that you can learn as well. So if you don't care for spoilers, here you go. I mean... Oblivion Wig is probably the best move that he can get from the egg move considering that it heals you and it's a stab move since he's also a flying type. Let's see. Sky attack. No thanks. Dragon rush. I'm good. Arrow blast, I guess. I mean, would you really use uh, a Lugia? It's like the... The discount version of Rayquaza in a way. They both have Delta Stream. I mean, if you if that's all you got, man, might as well just use it. I'm not one to complain. If you lose a Pokemon, you die IRL? No! the site um the command is exclamation mark dex dex do that anytime you need to pull up the site i'd do it but both my arms just fell off sort of online poke rogue style wait i can't log out
I need some better moves on this guy. Pokerog does have similarities with Sword Art Online, so the idea of dying IRL is not that odd. Wait, I need Fake Out actually. Oh my god, Tika Tuff's evolving. This is like the first time you ever see me use uh, a Tika Ton. website yeah props to whoever made it they definitely put in a, a lot of work honestly I've been using like Bulbapedia and uh, Pokemon DB but this one has been more um, since it's like directly influenced for uh, Poke Rogue it's definitely uh, a lot more informative for sure for sure for sure do you think in Sao if someone shouted a racial slur the system would auto ban them and it would kick them out saving them no because the guy didn't he die <laughs> didn't the admin die or something who even uh, runs the game anymore okay i'll take psychic You think people gold farm and <laughs> you think people sell services and sort of online? <laughs> Probably. Oh yeah, they definitely do. <laughs> you ever seen the VR chat community? Oh yeah. If that was uh, sort of online, you know for sure they're doing something. How come I haven't seen a furry in Sword Art Online? Honestly, I only watched like the first season. I don't know anything else about the, the anime. Just came in to drop a follow and chill though. I'm going to catch my sleep. Have a great rest of the stream and have fun with the stream everyone. Good night my brother. Have a good rest. Tomorrow we do it all over again. There are furries. I know there's like cat girls and stuff, but like I wouldn't really consider them furries. Oh, speaking of which, uh, I mentioned this yesterday in my stream, but I'm going to an anime convention for the first time on Sunday. So that's exciting, I guess. We're getting rolled by this Excadrill. Can someone assist me? I'm flinching. You gonna cosplay? No, it was like a last minute thing. Um, one of my friends owned a restaurant and the owner of the convention actually stopped by and they gave him eight tickets to the convention. So since I know him, uh, he gave me one of the tickets. So we're just going impulsively. You would have made a cute Nezuko? Oh no. Who would win in a fight? Superman or Tanjiro? I was reading this post honestly. Um, <laughs> it was one of those like um, what if situations and they're like what if Tanjiro could stop the rumbling? <laughs> you think he could stop the rumbling? This guy could barely even like breathe without choking.
Hey, he's cosplaying Miku in My Life Is Yours. Which one? From the, the rabbit one? If you know what I'm talking about. Why are we playing with Garganako? I should switch. Wait, he's so strong? Bonk. A lot of fun, just be aware of some people as there are weirdos. It's alright. I'm not there to talk to anybody anyways. And we're most likely going as a big group, so... I might just be doing my own thing. What if I actually run into someone that watches us on YouTube? Imagine. Oh my god, are you that Poke Roll guy? Beware of the weeb smell too. It's okay, we could just like pass out deodorant or something. How come there is no like deodorant sponsor at those conventions? You see stalls for like everything, but not like hygiene stuff. I bet you like Manscaped is gonna be there now. Ace, don't dive into the Miku rabbit hole. What if I told you guys I was a Vocaloid this whole time? What if my voice wasn't real? Oh, have you guys been getting the issues with the text being like censored? You see it for like the stats and sometimes for uh, the text. I got a tier 2 shiny Archlodon boss earlier. It gave me 20 candies. Oh, we balling. You know this guy was out trick-or-treating. People gonna watch my video and then gonna see like all the, the missing no text and it's like, yeah, this guy's definitely hacking. He's playing on a pirated game. Quarter showers, you know how much money they would make in terms of like, you know, like maid cafe services? What if there was like a shower service where they like just take a pressure washer and just hose you down? You know they would pay for that. And they could make so much money too. Wait, I'm gonna set one up. Guys, don't take my idea. The pressure washing simulator game is gonna like be stonks now. Wait, why do I even have this guy? Does anybody remember me catching this guy? <laughs> Wait, where did he come from? I'll be honest, I don't even remember catching him. <laughs> uh, we got lost in the sauce. Just got a blue shiny Entei? Goddamn. Wait, how are you guys so lucky right now? Y'all. There has been a secret pattern in his schedule that actually tells the exact date of the face reveal. You think I would ever do a face reveal? Hell no. I'll do it for two rare candies. Yeah, I didn't even know we caught this guy, honestly. But I'm, I'm mostly just playing on autopilot and just chatting. Face reveal for the five Pokeballs. You know, sometimes you complain about having Pokeballs. 
And then like it gets to the point where you're trying to catch a Pokemon and all you have is just like five Pokeballs left and you're like, oh man, I hope this actually works. Only during classic runs. Okay, we got the grippers. Put the grippers away. We don't even have a steel move. Can I redeem your channel points instead of my own? If you're able to log into my account, sure. Mom told me it's my turn to log into the account. Imagine having to share Poke Rogue accounts. I guess you can since you have like multiple save files. Mewtwo, low-key, not even that good. Yeah, I'm not feeling him right now. I'm gonna get rid of this guy. Not Mewtwo, I met the other guy. <laughs> Maybe Mewtwo too. Would be cool if you could save, could name the save files. Yeah, might as well add nicknames so, for Pokemon. I mean, they're they're trying to balance the the whole abilities and everything, and all the passives. Like, did anybody really ask for that? Honestly, is there any point in changing it? I'm not even the same game anymore. You should use Rayquaza. Oh wait, never mind. Too soon, man. I'm gonna cry myself to sleep now. I'm gonna do a sleep stream. I lost. In the games, I, o I only catch legendaries in Pokeballs. Yeah. It makes it look cooler too. You will get him soon. It's probably gonna be my last one. We'll see. I definitely will pull for it when it's in the shop. Does Rayquaza have a red shiny? Yeah, Nep, um, if you do exclamation mark dex, I'll do it for you. You click that link and then go over to Rayquaza. You can even check it right here. It shows all the shiny versions of it. So the regular shiny, the rare, and the epic. You can also do it for the mega as well. Looks pretty cool. I'm not really feeling the color for this one though. I guess it looks okay. The This one though, damn, you know? Wow. <laughs> That color is sick. The blue shiny? I, I guess it's alright. I'm just so used to seeing it from the rival that it's just not like, eh. I guess it'll be different if I have it myself. You know, if, if it's yours, then yeah, for sure. It's like, damn. But the last shiny is just like, eh, I don't know. When are they going to add <laughs> vanity items in this game? Allow you to choose a skin. What if you can purchase clothing for your team? Mewtwo with a top hat? Cowboy Pikachu? The 
Okay, is going to be in a shop on the 20th. I'll see you guys on the 20th if I survive that long. Uh -uh. Oh, one, two, three. Welcome on in. Thank you for follow. Zacian's on the 16th. Oh, yeah, we're going to get him. I'm going to get like five of them. Anybody want one? He just disappeared. Do I have any flying types? If you go to the Poke Rogue chat for the main server and then go to the pins, you can scroll down and find a message of the dates. Oh man, you couldn't pay me to open up that Discord. I now sentence you to 30 minutes in the Poke Rogue general chat. Still waiting on my Twitch integration for a possible chat name battles naming Pokemon features. Oh yeah, that'll be nice. That's so innovative for a game like this, having it like Twitch integrated. I can see that happening, but man, for such a like a game where it's just like there's no funds that's going into it and they're just doing so much in terms of like updates. It's commendable for sure. Twitch plays Poke Rogue. Good times. I remember when they first did the idea for uh, the original Pokemon games. People loved it. Now they love the. Can an AI beat Pokemon? <laughs> I programmed this AI to beat Pokemon Red. I just tried using a normal type move. Wave 1000 is the G Max version? Yeah. Honestly, it shouldn't be all that different from the usual fights. Every time you see a trainer rival gym, it can replace it with a chat username. Yeah, honestly, that's a really good idea. Damn, Jesse, what are you cooking up right now, dude? Oh, but it gets flamethrower. Or your skill type. I'm getting rid of Swift. See you later. Thank you, Amy. You are a lifesaver. What will we do without Amy? Anybody here have a Mewtwo? Can someone tell me what's so good about this guy? I'm trying to find uh, the hype right now. But I'm just struggling. Oh no. I have a Mewtwo but I haven't used it. The only reason why I'm using it is because people wanted to see a Mewtwo run. But then like I couldn't think of anything to like fuse him with besides like Mawile or Tinkaton. And I'm like, oh, I gotta make this guy a physical attacker. I could also try it with Calyrex, I guess. You know, Psychic and Ghost-type. Probably not going to be that good. 
die to like one dark type move. Ouch. Mega Mewtwo fused with huge power Pokemon does really dumb damage. Let's see if we can even make it that far first. We might lose it to this Gengar here. We don't even have money to revive the boy. He's gone forever. Give him... Ah, uh, yeah, I'll just take that. Oh my god, and there's a Paradox Pokemon on 100. Guys, say GG to the run. Okay, we'll Toxic this guy. I guess it doesn't matter. I have nothing. He still survived? Actual cringe. Okay. Yeah, it's Cook, just restart. If I'm gonna restart, I'm not gonna do Mewtwo anymore, I'll tell you that much. <laughs> Sorry, we're chilling. We got Among Us. Does every Pokemon have a blue or red variant shiny? Yes. Um, I'm not sure about most legendaries, but yeah, most of the Pokemon in this game does. Amoogus. Wait, this Golduck just called me disabled? I'm reporting him. I came and one shot them. <laughs> it was such a sad day. Sue Bell. Okay. The thing is, I wanted um, Unnerve for Mewtwo and I couldn't even get that. I got pressure. What am I gonna do with pressure? I was considering on doing a legendary tier list. Um, only like straight up legendaries, not like sub legendaries or mythicals. Only the ones that you can pull from like uh, a legendary egg. Mewtwo, where, where do you think we should put him? I'm I'm calling him right now like B tier. Mewtwo fanboys clenching their fists right now. Plates are in the game. What for Arceus? What's the best plate for him? Dynamax. Yeah, I'll take that. Oh my god, no way, it's Pokemon Trainer Orange. Mewtwo ain't bad, just power crap since Gen 1 for real. His stats are so good too. They just need to give him like some better movesets. <laughs> Alright, what are the odds of us catching this guy? You guys feeling it? You think this is where it's gonna be? Oh my goodness. We're dead? Oh, we tanked that. Wait, Mewtwo? He's up on A tier because he tanked that.
Just eat the ball at it. Let's see. Okay, one more. Surely he doesn't die to this, right? No, looks. Let's, I'm, I'm scared. This might actually take down two health bars, so we'll just play it safe. There we go. Two Terrapagos. I could try it. I've never tried them before, so I don't know how to use it. You need the shards for it, right? Okay, if we can't um, catch him here, I will give the run to Giratina. He deserves it. If he wipes us here. Good games. We'll catch him again. We'll see him on like floor 10. Alright guys. Mewtwo ain't it for me. I will give Mewtwo um, like a 6 out of 10. He was okay. But he just didn't have enough coverage. We, we had Moonblast and one Psychic move and Swift and like a Rock type move. There wasn't much that we can do. Draw Terrapagals? Let's see. Terra Shift. Okay. 